What would you have me? Well, I am Mizena, faithful of Tempus. Praise be to the Lord of Battles. flock to her cause and serve her fiercely. Some claim her the daughter of a god. Others believe she possesses a divine heritage but generations removed, an Asimar. Her closest advisor is a priest who calls himself the revered brother Heffernan. He claims to serve not one god or pantheon, but all of them. Kalar has accepted this heresy. I have many fine wares. Cap set. Watch us too. We've been marching hard, covered a lot of ground, but we've still a ways to go. Everyone could use a rest, yourself included. Tonight might be the last full night's sleep we get. We'll be in Crusader territory after we cross the bridge. Yes? Right. Hurry up! Very well. Your wit, if you insist. Hmm? What? Hmm? What? Oh, uh, yes, 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 you are, aren't you? That's fantastic! Well, if you'll excuse me? My name! Oh, right, right, my name! I'm Glint. Glint, Three Eyes Gardner Simpson. Pleased to meet you. And you don't know any more now. I know who signed up for this mission, and Glint Gardnerson wasn't on the list. Gardnerson's son. Two sons, long story. I don't give two tugs of a dead dog's tail what your name is. What are you doing here? Oh, all right, you've caught me. I'm not supposed to be here, not officially at least. My mom definitely thinks I should be here, and it's usually easier to go along with her than argue. You haven't met my mother. Family's very important to the Gardner Sun Sons. I have a number of relatives twixt Baldur's Gate and Waterdeep. Mom wanted me to check on them and make sure they're all right. That could get ugly. Thank you. I'll report in immediately. They dearest too fast on the path of right. Correct nine what? steps. Oh, I didn't see you there. Well, I did. Obviously I did. I'm talking to you. I must have. But it took me a while. Sorry. What were we talking about? What would you have me do? Ah, it has been too Your long orders? since Minsk journeyed with such a Your fine wish? companion. Very well. An army marches on its stomach. Hurry up! What would you have? Very well. I need a swig of some strong dwarven ale.
You did not think me truly dead, did you? We've a bond between us, you and I. A connection even the sharpest blade cannot sever. A bond forged in blood, hatred, death. I held the sword coast by its throat. It wriggled and squealed in my grip. And then... You. I should have killed you, as I had so many others. But something stayed my hand. A weakness I had never known before. Are we one and the same, my brother? One soul in two bodies, born of the Lord of Murder? We will never end. You understood none of this, did you? Do you see now? All right, all right! My timber's bad enough without ye bothering me! I do not know if I fully trust thee, Stefana. I wouldn't if I were you. My mother always said, you can always trust a man to do the wrong Hurry thing, up! but never trust a woman to do anything. Thy mother had a dim view of humanity. She knew humanity well. That does tend to adversely affect one's view of it, in my experience. thy mother's daughter. So she claimed. I have my doubts. All right, all right! Order is what matters. Order is what matters. Good day, and hello to you. I much prefer wooded regions, but one must be flexible in these times. Your chattering's starting to wear on me nerves. This and that to be done, no time to stay and chatter. What are ye looking at?
They mock me. Me! This cannot stand. This, this would have... shows promise. What is this? Where did you come from? Careful, Odessiron. You can trust no one. Thou runnest, or should I say, waddlest, away from the Shining Lady? For the love of the gods, save that filth for a chamber pot. You, Odess, Odi, wizard, do you know where Kalar can be found? Regret this decision. And when you come crawling back to me, begging Odesseron to save you, I shall look down and whisper, No! A word? I want to talk about that little speech you made before we left the gate. All right! I've what traveled with a lot do? of great people in the past. All more right, than you might right. believe. But this is the best team ever. Your wish? All right, all right! What would you have me do? If you insist. Mind your box! They're behind us now, too! Unsheathe your sword! Boo's nose, it twitches. 
There is evil here. And? Sign again, cold heart. Hurry up. you have me do sweet right Right. Have me do. All right, all right. You've returned. What did you find? Any sign of Gern Cold? This group shows promise. Extraordinary. Gather your party before venturing forth.
If you insist. I need a swig of some strong dwarven ale. Very well. You've returned. What did you find? Any sign of Gern and Cole? The timber's bad enough without ye bother on me. Aware on me nerves. They called. Hey there. Aye. What would you if you insist?
decide whatever thy will. Hurry up! Your life ends here. Hmm? Would you have me do? Yeah, yes. This group shows promise. Extraordinary.
Team like this can't be beat. You called? I'm listening. Trouble? you have me do? Your way, if you insist. It has been too long since Minsk journeyed with such a fine companion. What do you need? Hurry up! All right, all right! Time to 
go. Yep. Sweetheart? Right. Would... All right, all right!
shall give. I'll recover. for ancient tombs or any scrolls that might contain lost artifacts. Another try, I shall be. I'll recover. I'll recover. I'll recover.
Hurry up! Hey there, whatever you like. I understand. What would you have me do? Your wish? What would you have me do? Insist. This is the most fun I've had in weeks. Come for you anyway! Well, scrub devil! This is the most fun Hurry I've up. had in weeks. I demand. What would you have me do? Want me? Yes, dear. I wish.
have me do? <laughs> when danger calls, Minsk answers. Sword first. Your wish? All right, all right. I've traveled with a lot of great people in the past, more than you might believe. But this is the Sweetheart, best team ever. Whatever you like. My eyelids are as yep. Yes, dear. Your need. Whatever you like. What would you have me do? So tell me, Captain, how did someone like you rise so high in the Flaming Fist? It depends what you mean by someone like me. There aren't many mothers who'd rather fight zealots thousands of miles from home when they could be making their children dinner and putting them to bed. Circumstances don't allow many people, mothers or otherwise, to do what they prefer. Nonsense. I do what I will, where I will, when I will, with whom I will. Keep flapping your lips and I'll show you a pathetic creature, you little tart. Captain Corwin, please. I meant no disrespect. I know what you meant. Next time keep that thrice damned pit of hell you call a mouth shut or I'll shut it for you. I wasn't sure you would. I was curious. I had to learn who would be so arrogant, so foolish, as to summon me in such a fashion. Who are you who thinks himself my equal? My better, even, judging by your messenger's tone? Me? I am not but a servant. If you know who I am, you know that I do not deal with the servants of others. If your master would speak with me, I am happy to do so. Or has he grown so weak, even his words can no longer reach this plane? Do not doubt my master's power, or our allies. You think I doubt the Umbral Accord's power? If you respected it, you would not do as you did in Baldur's Gate. The child of Baal belongs to my master. I've done nothing to keep the godling from you. You are trying to influence Baal's spawn, and in doing so, you interfere with my master's business. The Accord will not let this continue. Perhaps you are right. Perhaps not. You do not speak for the Accord, and I do not bow to the demands of some broken fiend's lickspittle.
my name. You know my cause. But you do not know my story. Mine is a noble family, blessed in every way. The Argents are destined for greatness, or so some think. I thought it myself once. Thinking I could do no wrong, I wronged many, far too many. In time, I came to realize that my actions were not without consequence, that a price was paid, though it was not paid by me. I knew that had to change, but how? How might I redeem myself for my sins? For years, I prayed for guidance. And then one day, one glorious day, an answer was bestowed on me by the gods themselves. Many have been taken from this world before their time, lost in the Dragon Spear Wars, dragged down into the Nine Hells in defiance of the Holy Order of Things. Some believe they are gone, never to return. I know better. With you at my back, I swear to you, what was lost will be restored! Concentrate, girl. Clear your mind of all thoughts. That should be easy. A lot of people say there isn't much thinking going on in there to begin with. You are not without wit, Imowen, but that will only take you so far. What you need and currently lack is focus. Forgive me, Duke Janath. It's just... it's hard. My best friend is charging into a dragon's mouth, and I'm just sitting here, thinking about magic and stuff. If you were truly thinking about magic, you'd not be talking so much. I made a mistake. I should never have let them go face Kalar without me. In your current state, you'd be nothing but a burden. If you truly want to help your friend, you must focus your mind and your energies on your studies. You're right. I know you're right. All right. What am I supposed to do again? Clear your mind. Clear my mind. Right. I could do that. Clearing my mind. Clearing my mind. Mind being cleared. Clear mind. Cleared mind. Clear mind. Ah. Hurry up, if you insist. Hey there. Right. What would you very well?
I've traveled with a lot of great people in the past. More than you might believe. But this is the best team ever. Your wish? All right, all right. Have me do if you insist you've returned what did you find any sign of girl in cold heart Substitutes. Your wish? All right, all right! You must gather your party before venturing forth. If you insist. I hear. Hurry up! If you insist. Uh, who are you now? How did you come to this place? Forward march! What would you have me do? Have 
have me do? Your wish? Hurry up! What would you have me do? If you insist. Turn? Is Coldheart dead? Tell me you ripped the catchpenny bastard's head from his shoulders. some strong dwarven hail. like this can't be beat.
If you insist. You want me? Whatever you like. Hurry up! All right, all right! We're closed. Nature? Puh. Who needs it? Twigs in my hair, bugs flying around my face. Give me a city any day. You think this is beautiful, hmm? Anything else in the area that catches your eye? Brute! 
You think you can talk to me like that? You'd better think of something flattering to say about me, or I will make you regret the day you joined up with me. All my stuff is authentic. Really, it is. All my stuff is authentic. Really, it is. What would you have? All right, all right! Good day, and hello to you. I much prefer wooded regions, but one must be flexible in these times. Few of the fair folk concern themselves with the affairs of the state.
what? Marches on its stomach. What would you have? All right, all right! Young folks, would you like to ride up the path? A new bout should be beginning soon. of the one and only Payloff the Entertainer! Gather in the gallery, my gallants. Tis time for another test twixt two titanic terrors in Payloff's blackest pit yet. Fate favors you fortunate few who witness these feral foes in a furious fray. First, I give you the wild wonder of the Western Kingdoms. Wise men say only fools rush in to face the Wolverine! <laughs> but what wily wonder could conceivably win a war against the Wolverine? There is but one answer. That hardy, hate-filled horror, the Honey Badger! I 
I bid the battle begin! Patience, my peculiarly profound patrons. The primitive play you propose will be presented. Do I know you? Ah, yes. It's moderately mortifying to see you again. But the past is past, and these people pine for a performance. And so I give you... The Goblin! Let me out of here, Drow! Let me out! You'll have your freedom, my freakish friend. But first, you must fight for it. Let Lobbyer take you, Nightskin. Let me out! Silence, you simpering scullion! Think on this a tick, noble one. Have you ever met a goblin that didn't thirst for the thrill of the fray? Free me, snake! Recognize your role, you repellent wretch. I am the entertainer. I speak. You watch and applaud. Or remove yourself if I cannot concede to such contemptible, nay, criminal coercion. I'll concede you, silver hair. This spectral assault! I give up! My pit of plenty! Pauperized! Made pitiful by a pernicious porcupine of a goblin! What a woeful waste! We had a deal, Drow. You broke it. I should let the ghosts have you. This worm belly promised children food. Then he caged me. Sent me out to kill or die for pink skin scum. Forget this wretched rabble rouser. What will happen to me? Baloth Baratu. Showman of showmen. Entertainer of entertainers. You can't seriously intend for us to take this drow along with us to Dragonspear. I shall attend this camp, as you suggest. You'll find my wits and wisdom there when you need them. McKin's my name, of the Grub Doubler clan. I'm a shaman. Spirits listen to me. They do what I ask, if I ask right. I was told to assist you as best I can, but this is a bad idea. If this thing hurts anyone, I'll hold you personally responsible. Here, Goblin, take this note from me. It should keep my people from putting a spear through you on sight. It's a dangerous world for a Goblin alone. I'll wait at this camp, as long as no one tries to kill me. Ah, it has been too long since Minsk journeyed with such a fine companion. <laughs> for intelligent conversation? Hurry up! What would you have me do? Your way? Very well. Hurry up! Very well. At last I am free! Free!
Miriam for Kaleen and left me to die. Since then, my spirit has wandered these woods, voiceless and alone. Until now, thanks to you, I can sing once more. What is this? Where am I? Who? You. I remember you, Artivian. Foul one. I will destroy you. Destroy you all. Shows promise. Extraordinary. It's a hard life on the road. All my stuff is authentic. Really, it is. It's you again. Mm. We're still closed.
likes the forest. And I do too. There is much to nibble here. Yes, right. What would you have if you insist? Make way! Let's talk more fight! Your wish? All right, all right! Hurry up! What would you have? All right, all right! your party before venturing forth. Very well. Order 
is what matters. For Baldur's Gate. I need a swig of some strong dwarven ale. Yet thou wouldst support our group and keep our companions standing in the face of those who wish us ill. You're very well. has cost us this day. Heffernan, what happened here? The hero of Baldur's Gate arrived, lady. Unbound and unescorted by your elite, this man happened. He destroyed the bridge before our prey could cross. There is nothing to forgive, James. The fault is mine. I should have warned you of this possibility. It is time this child of Baal and I had words. Crusaders, stand down! Everyone lower your weapons! The Shining Lady commands it! Kill our Argent! I know you hear my words. I would speak with you. This may be our only opportunity to communicate directly with Kalar. We have to take it. This is new. She's never been willing to speak to anyone representing the Council before. If she'll talk to you, well, I doubt she's here to surrender, but we should hear what she has to say. And so the hero of Baldur's Gate comes from my head. Shall we speak and see what truth comes of it?
We stand poised on the cusp of a new age. Someday all Farron shall look to this moment and say, Then, that was when everything changed. I am not your enemy. Consider for a moment the poison my agent sought to use against you. It may seem that we stand on opposite sides, but it is not so. Our goals align closer than you know, and there is much we could achieve together. I am a drop of water in the river of my army. We will wash away all opposition. Return to Baldur's Gate. Tell the Council not to oppose me. Nay, no child of Baal am I, nor any other god. I am an Asimar, descended from a Solar that blessed my line generations ago. Is blood what matters to you? Or the message? In our lifetimes, two Dragonspear Wars have ravaged this land. Fiends set out from the castle, bringing ruin to the land, and dragging thousands of innocent souls into the Inferno before being beaten back for a time. Those who follow me lost wives and husbands, parents, children, friends. But what was lost can be restored. I will bring those tortured souls back to Toril. I do. And even should I fail, it is necessary. To not attempt it would be a greater crime. Would you hesitate if one of your own were cast into the Hells, whatever their deeds? Or would the Dukes be fighting you now to keep you from what you feel is right? Countless lives were lost as the fiends erupted from Dragonspear, a tide of hate and sulfur ravaging the land. None could escape. There was nowhere to run. Families, homes, loved ones. Every soul caught in a fiend's grip at the moment of their death. But it does not end there. They are taken to the Nine Hells. Their blood boils, their skin blisters and bursts. Devil's claws rend their soul, tearing it to shreds. But they cannot die. I hear them. I hear the screams of the unjustly damned. And I will not turn a deaf ear. You have done little to fight the calling in your own blood, and you cannot judge me for the same ball spawn. Murder beats in your heart, justice and salvation in mine. In the end, we will see which beats stronger. I regret the loss of those who stood against me, and trust that in death, they will come to understand what I could not show them in life. I will honor their passing with the return of the Dragon Spear dead. Your father was the Lord of Murder. Countless lives were stolen in his name. What if you could restore that balance, bring back those unjustly taken? Would you? Or is the call of your sire's blood too strong? Very well. If this is your choice, then meet me at Dragonspear Castle, and we shall end this. Arrogant. I serve the gods. You serve the corrupt, the ignorant, ones consumed with territory, gold, power. Is that also your legacy? Do you stand with them, or for something greater? Only I can challenge the fiends of the Nine Hells. I must carry my mission out to its end. You and I will meet again. Of this I am sure. We do not need to meet as enemies. Reconsider your course, I beg you.
So that was Kalar. I'm beginning to understand why so many have flocked to her banner. I've seen the arrogant prosper too often to count on it. But I hope you're right. Let's head back to camp. With Timora's favor, we might make Boriskir Bridge before the Crusade sets up another ambush for us. The Shining Lady is not the child of Baal some claimed her to be. Though she is not of Baal's blood, thou art. I shall remain with you on this expedition and see how it might illuminate the prophecies of the wise Alundo. Lead on. I shall follow. You have an interesting way of talking. I mean your language, not your means. My second cousin twice removed could make his posterior talk. Better company than he was. I do not understand what thou art trying to say. See, it's that, that right there. These and thous and thines. Isn't it easier to use yous and yous again and yours? When one's power comes from incantation, it is a wise witch Laren who keeps her tongue limber. Oh, oh, oh! So you do it to retain clarity. Make sure your mouth can form. Is there something I can do for you? I simply thought that if we're to travel together, face Kalar Argent together, we might do well to get to know one another. Let's concentrate on the mission then. If we can do what the Grand Dukes have asked, I'll be satisfied. You think it'll be easy? I admire your optimism, if nothing else. Let's go. Perhaps that is the truth. Perhaps I just prefer a more formal ethic. You are welcome. You're not going to tell me one way or the other, are you? Oh, I like thee. If you've got their gold, stop yammering and hand it over. Is that... 
Is that a bust of the hero cast in gold? I have many fine wares. Hurry up! All right, all right! What's going on? It'll take us some time to break camp and scout the best way for the troops to take. Meet us at Bridgeport when you're ready. I'll mark the directions on your map if you don't know the way. Order is what matters. Order is what matters. This and that to be done, no time to stay and chatter.
Insist. Stop there. Are you living or dead? Isabella, please. They're clearly alive. Crusaders? Do we look like we've nothing better to do than fan a mad woman's ego? No. The work we do has actual value. Right now, we hunt a vicious undead creature. Keep out of our way. We have the vampire cornered. He's riddled the path with traps, so we can't get to him. But by the same token, his only way out is through us. Meet us here after dark if you want to help us finish this. Hello? I thought I heard something. Who's there? Hey there. Right. What would you the have? The forest is well? so serene. I always catch myself watching for bandits, though.
it is good to see a friendly face in the wilderness. I come to join you on your quest, if you will still have me. I took some time to reflect on what really matters in this world. Helping the needy is a worthy ambition, but Baldur's Gate is not where I should be right now. Would that I could tell you, my friend. I am grasping at shadows, perhaps real, perhaps imagined. I will not drag you into my darkness, not until I know the truth. When my path is clear, you will be the first to know. Until then, I would join you, if you'll have me. If that is your wish, my friend, may Selune smile upon you. Very well. What would you if you Your wish? Hurry up! Very well. Aye! Let's talk more fight! What would you have me do? Who's there? My name is Solak, though that is of little consequence. What matters is that I've done no harm to these fanatics so bent on my destruction. I ask you, is this right? Enough talk! Kill the monster, now! Hurry up! If you insist. You're a 
a woman of the world, Safana. You've experienced everything Toriel has to offer in all its glory and perhaps its score. <laughs> yes? Are you calling me old? What would you have very well? What? Well. No! You knee-biting little vagabond. I am a young woman in the prime of my life. I We're hunting a vampire. What news? Again, and I'll slap you so hard it'll knock the taste out of your grandmother's mouth. Forgive me, Safana. I just wanted to ask about your life in Baldur's Gate. You seem like such an interesting person. You have been waylaid by enemies and must defend yourself. All right, all right! me? Your wish? All right, all right! You must gather your party before venturing forth. If you insist. My eyelids are as heavy as lead! Or steel! Or gold! Hurry oh, up! Let's say gold! What I mean is, I'm tired. I'm 
looking Keep forward fighting. to this. Magic does not nest well in a tired mind. Ah, I must sleep. Hurry up! You must gather your party before venturing forth. If you insist. Minsk has a message for you. For me? From who? It is from Boo. He would like to say that you are a very pretty lady. Yes, and Boo has excellent taste. So this is quite a compliment. Uh, relish. Your rat thinks I'm pretty, hmm? That's adorable. Boo is no rat. He is a miniature giant space hamster. Do not offend him, lest he nibble your ears off in your sleep. What would you have Rat, me do? Rat, hamster, what's the difference? What is the difference? Oh, Safana, you have so much to learn. Ah, it has well, been too long rats since are much larger than space Except giant space hamsters, of course. Those are larger even than Minsk. Who likes the forest? And I do You've too. You've given me much to there think about. Much to Why don't you here. bother someone else while I do so? Good boy. Oh, you insist. it's you again. Mm. We're still closed. All my stuff is authentic. Really, it is. Hurry up! All right, all right!
have many fine wares. Yes? Sweetheart? You want sword first! What would you have? Huh? 